hello everyone welcome back so in this video we will see uh, how to get calls uh, from man companies so i'll try to explain uh, what are the steps that you need to follow and how you should prepare your resume so that you get your calls and also i'll explain how to uh, get calls faster and where to apply and how to do that so basically this video is for uh, people who all who says that like they don't get calls often uh, they don't know how if the resume looks good or how the resume should be right so here uh, i'll also uh, tell the tips like uh, in order to get the calls what you need to do so let's get started first so this is my resume uh, which i generally used use for uh, cracking big companies so in order to get an interview call uh, if you follow this format right i can definitely say that uh, you will definitely get shortlisted and uh, uh, you'll get the calls easily and it then it depends on you whether how you crack those interviews so Uh, coming to my story uh, with this resume i got interview calls from google amazon apple right and those are all uh, <clears throat> those calls all three of them i got uh, from linkedin that's strange because uh, earlier uh, before three months i did not get any calls from linkedin not even uh, one single startup or uh mnc but when i change my resume format uh the way how i have projected my skills i got call from uh, three big companies that is google my uh, amazon and apple <clears throat> so if you have to uh, prepare your resume how i have done uh, let's just i'll just explain uh, how i have done you in the similar way you can do that right if you see the resume whoever looks that it looks very simple it's 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 short it's very short if you can see here i did not write lot of things i did not mention lot of things here whatever is needed for the interviewer to uh, scan through your resume in very short of time that thing only i have included so if you see in the header right i have added my name and my ed- latest ed- educational qualification and the college and below i have added a linkedin profile so if you see right the font size for name i have used calibri 18 and uh, for the text below uh, i have used calibri that and 11 and if you see here uh, on the right side i have mentioned my github page okay you can mention your mobile number email id and if you have any youtube channels or anything open source you have contributed those links you can mention right coming to uh, the next section you have to mention on the top those things which you feel uh, are the best things you have done in your career because those things only uh, uh, there is saying called the first impression is always the best impression so in order to create the first impression you definitely have to uh, present your best first <clears throat> so for that i feel uh, i have done little bit of innovations i feel those are the best things which i have done till now so these are all the things which i have uh, uh, placed at the top so for example uh, i have developed a chrome extension okay i have developed a library uh, to compare two json payloads and these are the corresponding links i have developed a generic automation framework for backend testing i have done apache kafka automation and i have developed a utility called uh, all jenkins job consolidator so i have mentioned the links also if i just go to this link right it navigates me to the uh, plugin which i have developed if you, you can see here like if interviewer sees this he'll definitely go through the link he'll try to see how many users are using that so def- it will be a definitely a plus point for you when compared with other people so this is a json structure validator 
similarly this is uh, this is the github uh, project i mean the uh, i have placed this in github this library can be used whoever wants to it they just have to clone and use similarly this is the backend automation framework it is also a github i, I have placed it in github uh, apache kafka automation and uh, Jenkins job consolidator. So these are the things which I have done apart from my regular work that shows like uh, if you keep these things right that shows an interviewer that you are passionate about uh, your profession and you do more than what uh, is assigned to you right. Next uh, core competencies there is a section called core competencies which I have added here <clears throat> you can uh, crisply mention what what are your strengths what you can do what you have done uh, in terms of your role uh, let's take an example uh, i have uh, a first point i have mentioned is that i have extensive experience in automation framework i have designed fr frameworks for front end back end and kafka okay this is my strength uh, which i have mentioned also i have innovated and developed tools which help uh, test automation engineers okay and uh, you can mention your expertise on which which tools and technologies and programming languages you have used and uh, uh, that you can mention also i've mentioned like uh, i can take ownership of the work that uh, is given i can take ownership and i can do the end-to-end -end testing for that that uh, thing i have mentioned so if there is anything other uh, other than that you can definitely mention but but make sure this is very crips don't add a uh, lot of things here just only add which you feel are best and that are needed uh, for this profile coming to the next section it will its work experience what you have done so if you can see right my work experience it's basically the latest companies you add first uh, okay Walmart uh, is my latest company okay uh, company name you have to add here your profile you have to add here what role you were and from which uh, time duration you have to add so here uh, you have you can mention your project name and basically what you have done in the project don't mention about your project functionality just mention what you did uh, in that project and how, and what are your contributions so uh, for example i have provided automation solutions in my project a uh, lot of innovations i have done okay and uh, some things i have written so maybe you can go through uh, i have i'll attach this as a reference for whoever is needed next company i have added uh, and the profile as well as uh, uh, time duration a uh, little bit about project one what you have done similarly uh, the other company and profile on the left side duration on the right side and what you have done so basically whatever you have done at that particular company at the particular uh, experience right right th that thing only like if you can see at the bottom will be uh, as a fresher I joined and uh, what I have done I wrote like I joined the team uh, I had learned automation selenium and all at that time okay i was exploring the existing frameworks and uh, running the automation scripts so straight away i didn't write like i have developed automation frameworks and all initially whatever i have done i have written that going on the next company how you have improved from there uh, that you can write in what are the things you have achieved that you can write in the latest uh, company and uh, in the end i have mentioned education uh, simple i have mentioned like btech what is the duration what is the percentage and all and at the last uh, what you are doing for your community like if there is anything that you are doing you can mention otherwise uh, no need of this so with this resume i got calls uh, as i said from google uh, i have got calls from so i have got calls from google amazon and uh, apple so if you need any uh, more suggestions from me regarding how to apply one more thing i would like to uh, say here 
basically here uh, how to get calls right when you add your profile in Naukri when you upload your resume what you have to do you just have to update your profile every day no need to update anything just uh, save your profile every day and make sure that it is updated uh, at that particular time and keep your resume up to date don't mention anything out of that uh, and in LinkedIn try to create network with more people uh, with your professional whatever profession you are in uh, talk to them uh, uh, request them for uh, referral and if there is anything that needs uh, improvement ask them and uh, you can improve uh, based on that i hope you like my video please uh, share with your friends and subscribe to my channel thank you